Hi and thank you for joining me today at Kay Warner Studio. Today we have a haul and this haul is from Scrap and Stamp. Scrap and Stamp is a paper art supply store in Canada that services Canadians. It is in British Columbia. They have a $9.50 flat rate but if you order over $100 your shipping is free. All the items that I show today, if they still have them, I will have them linked in the show more section for Canadians and for the international and U.S. viewers, I will have links to other stores for your convenience. And if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to leave it in the comment section. Presently, Scrap and Stamp is offering $10 off a $25 or more order, excuse me, with the code PEN10. It's only good for one one order and that's it. So let's get at it. So I have two shipping envelopes here. Everything always comes wrapped. So I have few things here. This is MFT. This is um, this isn't a new release but I thought it was cute to do some cards for uh, this summer. This little gal is laying on a towel or an air mattress depending on how you add your color. You could make it both ways and it says wishing you fun in the sun. Beach ball, a beach bag and we have life is meant to be enjoyed and that's the truth. It is. And yes, it doesn't say what release this was, but I'm sure it was last summer. And then this here is a new release. This just cuts out the strips and you can put them back in or you can leave it blank. And this is the new, the new branding, which is nice. I like these stripes along the bottom. Very nice and catchy. That's quite a bit of difference between one and the other as far as um, catching the eye. So yeah, this is a new one. And then I bought the coordinating dies for the Pure Innocence is what this line is called. Anytime you see this gal, she's called Pure Innocence. And they're designed by somebody called Bernie Birdie Brown. And so you have the sunglasses. I didn't notice if there were sunglasses. There isn't a stamp, but they have them there. So that can be, you know, cute. You can do that with anything, tortoiseshell or black or white. Or Then you have the beach ball, this uh, beach bag, and this image here. So we'll cut it out nicely. And then this is part of the new release. It's got the older design there. So let's compare those two now that I have them side by side. Oh yes, what a difference. You can see that. Isn't that nice? I'm really liking this. This is um, a new color that's out this year for a lot of different stamp companies are using that. So this is a, a beach scene. So you have your palm tree, you have your clamshell uh, clouds, here palm fronds um, coconuts this is another shell like a conch shell your tree and then here you can cut this and have this part here but maybe I'll open this and see how this comes apart so this stock number is MFT 1108 if you're interested but as I said I'll put links below. So these come out. Okay, great. I wanted to show you this. So you can cut this or this is your sand and this is your water or you can do it the opposite way. Have this your sand and this your water. I'll turn it that way. Yeah, so this can be your sand, your water, or you can put it this way and have this your sand and that your water. It's totally up to yourself. But isn't that nice that it goes either way. I think it's great so you can be a little more inventive and see how nicely these things all stick back into that magnetic sheeting. So that's great. So that was one order. And then the next order 
here we have this purple. This is almost like a bag, the way they have it taped. So that's nice. Okay, here I went nuts on the Penny Black stuff. Oh, look at this little guy here. Isn't he cute? It's called Doggy Treat. And this is also a, a one that's um, not a new release, but this is by Mo Manning, and I kind of like everything that uh, she designs. But look at that treat and question mark. I just can't wait to get this done. Very nice. So I like that one. Then here I have something that I purchased because I thought this might be nice for the painting class. Um, so if you're interested in the painting class that's going to start here on Sunday, if you can pick up a, a stamp something like this or if you have a stamp like this in your stash, you may want to get it out. Um, we're going to do some work. And uh, there's no, this is called Fresh. Very nice. She makes beautiful stamps. And then this is a die. Happy birthday. I have some formal script fonts, but this is good for a kid. And it's large. Larger than you might assume. So let's see now. I'll open that. The trusty ruler here. So the height is one and a half inches. Or the width, depending on how you do it, how you want to. And the length is three and a half. So that's a good size. So it'll fit across a card either way, which is always nice. And I, then these are cute. These are beautiful dies. And so it cuts this angelfish. And then this one here. And I'll show these to you too. And they come apart. I'm just going to leave them together because it's easier that way. So there's actually three fish here, which I didn't notice when I bought it. This little fella here. And then these two here. So the angel fish, the width is one and a quarter. It will be one from the from the right here, this edge here. I guess it's the nose. Fish have nose. is um, one and a half. And then the length, so we're going to go from tip to tip, is three. So that's a good size. And then this little guy here, look at the lips on this one. <laughs> so that lip to the center of that is two and a half. So it's from here to the tip of the lips. And then from fin to fin, it's two inches. So that's a good size. And this little guy, I'm not going to measure him. But you could put a plain piece underneath it, which is what I think they have done here. They have a plain piece of cardstock underneath, and then they have this design cut out, which is this design here. And then it's laid over the top. And this is done the same way. So that's really cute. And then you have the stitching all along the angelfish, which is, see if you can see that, I don't, up here you can see it. Very fine. It shines through because the color is so bright. And then this next one is a doozy. I think it's very pretty. So this is going to make a panel. And these dies are compatible with everything. So this is how it looks when it's done. Just this image here. This whole frame with the, um, my goodness, dragonfly on the inside. So here's your frame. I'm sorry if I have you out of, I had to reposition the camera. So I'm, this is your frame here. And then your dragonfly, which is the same here. Your frame with your dragonfly. And it goes that way when it's cut out. But let's have a look at the blades here. And they've done the same technique where they overlaid. They cut the blank uh, all one piece of a bright color. And then they laid the darker shades with this intricate design over the top. And so that's, a, that's an easy card. So let's have a look at this. So from blade to blade, it's three and a quarter. 
by four and an eighth. So that's pretty good. And then this dragonfly, which comes over the edge there. So that's a nice little effect. So we'll measure it here. So the actual span of the dragonfly is three and three quarter inches. So nice, very nice. And then you can you could even cut these all off if you wanted to, or just leave them like that. So that's pretty special. I like that. So that's my orders from Scrap and Stamp. And like I say, I will list these all in the Show More section. And these are actual size on the outside. So that's it there in the white. Here are the fish. Then you have the happy birthday, that's the actual side as well. This is called fresh. So yes, if you have some kind of a, a flower or you have a bud, as well as an open flower, so it can be anything. It can be poppies, daisies, geraniums, whatever you like. We have the treat. And then I have the dynamics, the, the beach scene, the full card for the background or just cut this all out and stick a flower on it or this dog or whatever and you're done and then we have here the beach people so thank you so much for joining me very happy to have you tune in to my videos this is a haul from scrap and stamp so thank you so much taking time out of your very busy day to spend it with me bye bye